Today we're going to learn how to make a gritty cinematic image in Adobe Photoshop. To do that we're going to mess around with adjustment layers, blend modes and a couple of filters as well. So to start off drag and drop the image that you're going to use into Adobe Photoshop and I'm going to use this image of Bear Grylls. Just hit enter to place the image and then press ctrl and j to make a duplicate of the background image. The next thing to do is add a black and white adjustment layer in the layers panel. Wait for it to turn black and then change the reds slightly to the left to add a bit more darkness. And adjust the yellows slightly to the left as well to bring in a bit more light and add contrast. I'd say I was pretty much happy with that so I'm going to get rid of this panel. Next, change the opacity down to between 60 and 75%. I think I'll stick with 70 to make mine look pretty good. Now I'm going to merge the layers, so to do that, highlight the top layer. And then press Ctrl and E to merge. Now those two layers have been merged together. So create another duplicate by pressing Ctrl and J. Go over to Filter, Other, High Pass. I'd have the High Pass sort of set at about six pixels. It will vary from image to image, but just make sure you've got a clear outline as this will add a lot more depth to the image. Once you're happy, click OK. Change the blend mode to overlay and decrease the opacity to between 60 and 75%. I think I'll go with around 70%. Next on layer 1, make a new adjustment layer, but this time select color lockup. On the 3D LUT file, go down to the bottom and select teal orange plus contrast dot 3DL. Decrease the opacity to about 75%. And that's how you create a gritty cinematic image in Adobe Photoshop. I hope you like this tutorial guys. Do not be a pen tool. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel.